So today I'm gonna tell classic tales for children. So let's. So today I'm gonna tell the magical magic coins. So here it is, the magic coins. Let's start. In the olden days, there was a mean old man named Mr. Max Stingy. Working for Mr. Max Stingy was a boy called Teddy Osher. He was a good worker but not very clever. However, after working for Mr. Max Shaw of a year with no payment but his foot and a roof over his head, when even Steady Osher began to wonder why he was not getting any wages. Instead, it time you pay me, paid me some money. Mr. Max Ninji, he asked one day. Mr. Max Ninji flew into a range. The mention of giving other people money always had that effect on him. If you are going to turn into a troublemaker, then you can be on your way, he shouted. Steady Osho hated unpleased trend and pleasedness. So, he put his few belongings into a bag and set off to find work elsewhere. One the way he stopped to say goodbye to the vicar at the local church. It is not right that you should live without wages, said the vicar to study Osho. Go back to Mr. Max Tingy and tell him that if he does not give you some money, I will send the constable round to see him. Not wishing to get into trouble with he with the constable, Mr. Max Tingy gave Steady Osho some forgiving coins. They are not of much use to me. I will give them to study Osho and tell him they are coins of great value and he will be pleased Mr. Max Tenji and had thought. So that he wa so that is, is what happened. And study Osho went to London and found work with a merchant who tra trained with countries abroad. As Teddy was a hard-working lad, the merchant took the trouble to find a foreign trader who would take the strange coins. They provide valuable and Steady was given a large sum of money. So, Steady had the last laugh over Mr. Max Tenji, which was only right as he was was an honest lad. The end. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.